everyone. Today I'm going to do four basic knot drops and that's about it. So let's jump right into the video. We're basically just going to have our knot, which I have a video on how to tie the knot linked in the description below. So you are all set with your knot and you have your backpack position. You'll then Struggle back, invert, and crochet your legs. Then bending one knee at a time, come up, grab the silks, and open your legs as you come around to make it easier. Make sure you keep your legs straight. Now, you're gonna cross your arms and pull up and through the silk, and go all the way through When you're ready to drop, you will lean forward and straighten your knees. You can end in a straddle. Our second drop is pretty easy. Same way as always. Straddle invert, hook one leg over both poles, and climb your way up the silk. Then sit comfortably in the silk, and on the count of three, you'll let go. One, two, three. You can then end like this. and sit in the silk when you're finished. Third drop, you will start just like always, and then start out the same as last time by hooking one leg over both poles. Climb up the silk, and instead of turning, you're gonna roll up, bringing your hip to the silk. Then twist back over, and hook the same leg. On the count of three, unhook your leg and bend it quickly again. One, two, three. Now you try. One of my favorites. You'll invert into a straddle back Crochet both legs, bend one knee at a time, and open to make it easier, keeping your legs straight. Then you'll lean back into another shadow invert, pose, hook one leg over both poles, and climb up the silk, sitting comfortably, just like the dive roll. On the count of three, when you let go, you want to do your first slip and then squeeze your shoulders inward so that you can fit through the silks. One, two, three. And finish like this. Thank you so much for watching my video and I hope that it was helpful to learn some new drops and I hope you have fun doing them. Bye everyone!